you guys welcome back to my channel thank you guys so much for joining me for today's video today i will be decorating my two-tiered tray in at least three to four different ways what i went ahead and i did is i shopped my storage closet all of my decorations and i pulled out everything that i thought could work well for an easter slash spring two-tiered tray and yeah i just basically shopped my house because as many of us know or most of us know we can't really leave our house my state is actually in a shutdown but i decided not to let that bring me down and i just a, I'm shopping online, you guys, because I do want to redecorate my house at least once more for spring. So again, if you are not subscribed, I definitely recommend subscribing if you guys enjoy this video, of course. And turn on your notification bell because I have exciting videos coming out. But anyways, I have a few like online shopping items coming in and I wanted to redecorate so I went through all of my decor and I pulled out anything that I thought could work for a two-tiered tray and I'm gonna challenge myself to decorate it anywhere from three to four different ways and I did find a couple of unused Easter items that I never got to share with you guys but the first two items were these little bunnies I got from Hobby Lobby for $4.99 each 40% off and then I got these like carrots and eggs and moss eggs again from Hobby Lobby for about three or four dollars. And then from Target when my state declared it was like on shutdown, I did do a quick trip to Target because I I needed like milk and bread and like a couple like groceries and I found these. So I grabbed 10 of these. This was after I had already filled my decorate with me so I never got to share it with you guys but these were a dollar each and I got 10. But yeah, let's go ahead and get right into it. I'm excited to show you guys with whatever I come up with. I hope this gives you guys some inspiration to just go through your own storage, your own decor that you guys already have. We don't have to go out, stay inside, stay safe. We can have fun with what we already have or doing online shopping. Like I said, there's no reason to leave your house and I'm hoping to show you this with this video. So let's get right into it. Okay, so to get started, I obviously have to add some type of ray done to my two-tiered tray. You guys already know this. This is very common in all of my displays. So I just decided to add this cream and sugar set. And then I also added a galvanized planter as well as a cement planter. I got both of them at Target a while back. But I tried to really play with materials in this display and I think that the galvanized touches as well as the cement and the wooden touches goes very very well in hand with the greenery that I used and then you'll be able to tell at the end when I add the tulips it just adds that pop of color that the tray needed and overall I really think that this was my favorite display and I honestly am going to go based off of this display to decorate the rest of my house for my next spring decorate with me so I don't know I'm just feeling very inspired especially after completing this display I think that all the elements look very like well paired together and I'm just in love with these two bunnies I honestly don't know why I didn't use them in my last decorate with me I think I was just afraid of using white because the color palette of my house is a new color palette to me so I was just a little bit afraid of using too much white but again I honestly love this display and I'm definitely going to use it as my inspiration piece for the rest of my house but you guys will have to let me know what you guys think overall and which one out of the four is your favorite one. Just say yes, choose to do whatever comes next
Now the idea for the second display was just to use a lot of greenery and just keep the color palette very neutral. So a lot of like whites and green, that was mainly everything that I wanted to use. I just wanted it to be very neutral, natural looking basically. So I just added this little uh, kitchen towel that I got from Target last year. It just has some herbs on it. This little wooden house in the front the same galvanized planter i got from target a while back and then i added a green vase from target's dollar spot now i got it a while back though with some greenery inside of it and then this little egg with galvanized ears i got from hobby lobby last year i just turned it around so the face was facing backwards and i just had like the um, blank face of it facing forward up at top, I added this piece of greenery, this planter with some more greenery, and then I did go ahead and add my Ray Dunn Mister. Again, I just felt like it went overall with this like garden theme, and it doesn't look like overly Easter at all. It's just a lot of greenery, and I feel this is more appropriate for like a spring display. And I added a quick like elements of wood with that bunny up up top and that was basically it i also really like this one however i don't think it is my favorite but i do definitely think it would go with a lot of the themes i've been seeing going around in like our spring home tours and so on so let me know what you guys think down below i added this cute little bird that used to be like a place card holder and i added it to this planter Okay, so for my third display, I did want to make this one a little bit more colorful and more cutesy, I guess you could say. I found these two little rabbits that I got last year, and I just think they're the most adorable thing ever. It's the little, like the bunny, the girl bunny, and then the guy bunny. They're just so cute, so I decided to just add some fun and some color to this display by adding my hip and hop Ray Dunn set. This set is like a very light pastel pink. I added the bunny with some greenery underneath it as well as a galvanized tin with some lavender in it just to add that pop of purple again. I wanted to keep this fun and colorful and on the side of the bunny I just added some Easter eggs. Over on the top like top part of the display again i incorporated some more of that galvanized material that i have on the bottom i did the same thing at the top with this water that i got and then i added the boy bunny the cement planter i got from target again a while back i've had all of this stuff for a very long time and I just added some greenery into that planter and another little Easter egg that I decided to take off but I think it came out so cute And the last display is the same one that I had in my decorate with me for spring as well as my spring home tour that went up last week if you guys haven't seen that I definitely would appreciate it if you can go and watch that video right after you're done with this one I'll link it up above in the i card but this is the exact same one I had in those two videos and again it's just another option with things that I already had that I already owned and I still wanted to show it to you guys because just in case some of you guys didn't see my decorate with me and you guys were just tuning in for like tear tray display ideas I wanted to include it in this video but that was basically the last and final display you guys and yeah again like I said I really like this one it is currently the one that I have in my house so I hope you guys also like it
and that is everything for this video you guys i hope you guys enjoyed it i hope this gave you guys some inspiration again if you have not subscribed i would really appreciate it if you did don't forget to give this video a thumbs up turn on your notification bell for future and upcoming exciting videos and i will see you guys in my next one